Morecambe Winter Gardens, England, is a Grade 2 listed building which originally opened in 1897 as the Victorian Pavilion Theatre. It was an extension to the existing Winter Gardens which were demolished in 1982. These days, Morecambe Winter Gardens is best known for being one of the most haunted places in Lancashire. And obviously Lancashire being a county that I am also in, and I am quite familiar with this building. I've never been inside, but I've heard numerous stories. Uh, it certainly is a very old, very, very old building. Probably one of the most oldest buildings in England. Um, now, the stage, because obviously it is a theatre, seems to be a particular hotspot for the paranormal. It is not at all uncommon for people on the side of the stage to be pushed, poked and even slapped by an unseen force. Well, that just says to me, you know, ghost of an actor or actors that have come back and, you know, obviously telling people in the current day that they're not doing a good job or not doing a good enough job. Now, there have been also been numerous reports of shadows flitting across the stage and a man and a young boy have both been spotted regularly. There are also said to be goats in the bar on the various stairwells and another well-known ghost includes the spirit of a seamstress who had dreams of becoming a professional dancer. However, she failed to achieve the fame that she so desperately wanted and now she haunts one of the dressing rooms and the auditorium. Well, the last part about the lady not getting the fame she wanted, maybe this this is a way of her getting that fame. You know, haunting um, a stage, dressing rooms, auditoriums. She seems to be very active in that place. And the Stirwell Ghost, there is an actual picture um, on the internet. You can actually type in um, Morecambe Winter Garden Stirwell Ghost and you can actually see that um, a young man or a boy wearing very old clothing is actually, you know, spotted on the stairs. Um, but this is definitely one of my more favourite, oldest haunted buildings in Lancashire. Obviously, where I'm from. And obviously, it is a place where hopefully me and my ghost hunting team can actually go one day and actually, you know, investigate for ourselves and see what we get. Um, but yeah, that, that's that's it for this episode. So thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe. Please share with your friends and family. And stay tuned for more, guys. And don't forget, follow the crow.